uh, another day with no increase. Is London really so crime free? I mean, again, I kind of get it that it kind of would be a bad thing for you that it would be so crime free, but still, come on, this is not a good thing. If you got nothing to do, why don't you tidy your desk? It looks like you're like a dog's dinner. Hey, Nix. Of course, you decided to join me now. No, don't. Don't make me kiss the mic again. The amount of papers and books and goodness knows what else is a disgrace. Don't you... Do No. Baby, no. Don't faça isso, por favor. Don't you worry, Cheryl. I have a system. I know exactly where everything is. That's pretty much every single messy person in the history of messy persons. Miss Layton, Miss Layton. Goodness, what is it, Ernest? Don't tell me that people alone have finally cottoned onto me. Cotton, cottoned? I, I don't know what that word means. Are they queuing down the street? Oh, I do wish they were, Miss, but sadly no. Oh well, that's a relief. Yeah, it would be so terrible for business if I had some clients. I can have to agree with Cheryl. Think about it, Cheryl. If people were queuing up to see me, I'd have no time for my afternoon tea. Ah, yes. Neeks! We need to get you some motivational training. It's not about being motivated. I'm, I'm holding back so I'm ready to, I can treat, to respond with pep and verve when the situation really demands it. Now then, what was your wanted, Ernest? Well, don't be surprised, miss, but... I won! What, the lottery? A pair of tickets to the exclusive pre-screening of the new film A Naval Advance, No Sub for Love. Eee, the title is just so... Eh? Really, that's great, Ernest. So, I was thinking perhaps you and I could go together, maybe? I mean, um, well, not as not as a work thing. Hmm, I don't know. Oh, please, miss. It's a Maverick director. Is this a pun on... Is this a pun on Mega Man? Maverick... I know it's supposed to be director, but Maverick direct... I don't... I'm so confused about it. film. I'll bet it'll be spiffing. Maverick director. Is he a famous filmmaker or something? Oh yes. He's a man of the moment in the film industry, miss. He breathes new life in the whole romance genre with the seminal work E.T. The extra hungry Teresa in Attack of the Munchies. Nix, no. No. Para. If that's a real film, I'm a professor of archaeology. I gotta agree with you on this one. What the heck is that name? It's got everything, Cheryl. Suspense, drama, animal romance. Um, what was it? What? Really, words can't do justice. Nix. So, what's this new film of his about then? The Naval Advance, No Sub for Love? Oh, it's about the... and... what? Nix! Just a second, guys. Baby, I don't want to see it. Stay in my call, stay. And it's about the love and emotions, and it's packed with edge of your seat action. And apparently it has a real twist at the end. Well, I think I feel overwhelmed already. The, the point is, it's a fantastic film, I'm sure. And there are oodles of famous actors in it. And the seats are supposed to be incredible too. The sets, sorry. I'm sure you'd love it, miss. That really doesn't sound like my cup of tea, Ernest. Oh. Yeah, you should have tried to go for the mystery movie. I think she'd be more interested in that. Don't give up, in stripes. Keep at her. Um, um, what would pick Miss Layton's interest? Of course! Um, Miss Lay, well, Miss, I've also been given a coupon for free po- Nix, no. For a free portion of the brand new durian flavored popcorn. But I don't suppose... Popcorn, you say? Yeah, of course, that's the thing that gets her, her attention, isn't it? I don't believe it. I mean... They're 
that worked! Really? <laughs> I swear, she was pretty much a stand for everyone else because it's so unbelievably surprised by everything she does. Which makes sense. I mean, I have to go with you in that case, Thomas. Where's the film showing? When do we leave? Now she's training on the lead to get there. The period is being shown at the Save Savoy. What's that? A famous cinema? Rather, the Savoy Theatre is known as a film buffs all over the world. By film buffs all over the world. I have no idea what that is. I'll probably check it out later. It used to be just a run-of-the-mill cinema, but then 10 years ago there was a huge renovation and it was turned into a luxury theatre. Since then, it's attracted all manners of cultural figures and celebrities from London. It's considered the heart of Brit British cinema now. I'm literally curious if that's an actual thing. Really? The cinema of choice for London's elite? Now I'm interested. The popcorn at such, at such a famous cinema is surely going to be to die for. Of course. But, but the film is what is exciting, miss. Leave it, pinstripes. We all know by now that the cat's ruled by her belly. You know, Jack makes a good point. If she's ruled by her belly, then couldn't you conquer her heart by, you know, cooking for her? In moderation, you don't want her to put in a few hundred pounds. Of course, yes, a preview screening at such a prestigious location is going to be a big event, obviously. Oh, it is. I heard it was... I was sorry. I heard that as well as the lucky winners like myself, all sorts of VIPs have been invited too. Really? Well, in that case, I'll have to dress up. As what? I would think I'd just go dress as I am now, actually. Well, not me. I have to make more of an effort. That's what a gentleman does. <sighs> I'll go and change now. Just give me a minute. Oh, Miss Levin, it's starting very soon, so please hurry if, if you can. Just give me a minute, she says. I know him is smaller longer than dog minutes, but this is take, takes a biscuit. She has been rather a long time, hasn't she? If we don't hurry now, we're going to miss the show. Here I am, sorry to keep you waiting. How many items did you try, K? I say, Miss! What is she wearing? Oh! Not bad, actually. What do you think, Ernest? Cheryl? Do I look silly in this dress? S silly? It's amazing what a dress can do. Hmm. Well, I was hoping for a little bit of a reaction at least. Well, never mind. We'd better be get going or we'll be late. Come along. Alright, let's go. Uh, an angel. Miss Layton is an angel. Ah, uh, Ernest. You really are... How shall I say... A lovable goof. Case 3. The Stolen Kiss. Here we are, Miss the Savoy. It is grand, isn't it? God even. <laughs> I've never been inside before, actually. I'm, I'm a little nervous. It's all a cinema. Yeah, come on, Pinstripes. Are you a man or a mouse? Because she'll eat you if you're a mouse. Sure, I'll behave. This just isn't something to be nervous about, Ernest. It's not like when I have an, to add another book to the teetering pile on my desk. Tidy up, then! <laughs> <laughs> Bad dog. Anyway, enough of that. There are a lot of people here, aren't there? Have they all won tickets, do you suppose? I expect so. It's, also, it's almost palpable, isn't it? How everyone's dying for the film to start. I know I am. Oh, look, miss, over there. Isn't that Emiliana? So it is. I wonder if that means, there, means something's happened. She could be here investigating. I haven't noticed any kind of commotion or anything. If there was an incident, there would 11 things. Never mind. 
Really? Let's just go and get information from the horse's mouth. A new case code has been added entitled Piper's Project. Right, new day. Oh. Of course. That's sure, hit coins are always in those places, I'm not sure why. Here as well, that's nice. Oh, the couple, I remember them. Miliana. I also remember this guy. Oh, he doesn't suck, thank god. Tsk, And these ignoramus call themselves fans. Ah, uh, hello! Are you Maverick the Director fan yourself? Me? Ha! Please don't sit me on the same stool as the rest of these open bracket, so-called close bracket fans. I'm a cineast, not a fan. Sorry? I have seen every single one of the director's films since his directorial debut. Open bracket, including, I might add, everything from the independent tiers. Close bracket. Well, well, I see you certainly aren't just a run of the mill fan, that's for sure. Exactly. In fact, I think you'll find Rector's earliest works were discerning pieces of art for the cinematic connoisseur. But of course, most recently he's gone for the crowd pleasures. Still, even in his more saccharine moments, his sublime composition, inimitable sense of style, and divine wordplay are present in spades. Jesus Christ! Of course, I can't comment on this particular film until I've seen it. Will it be his magnum opus or a massive flop? It's interesting to know that... that you've been talking for a very long time. Agreed. Um, is it still a time to go into the theater? Uh, yes. I'm afraid you're still setting out inside. If you could just be patient a little longer, yes? I'll just have to wait, Ernest. You can look around a little in the meantime, perhaps. Still can't believe it! Exclusive tickets to the preview of Maverick the Director's latest film. And you own them! You're the best, Benji! No, you're the best, best. The best for believing in me and giving me the confidence to enter the prize door in the first place. Oh, you. You're. You're just the best. And your luck is the best. I'm so proud of you. You know. There's supposed to be the best kiss scene ever at the end of the film. I can't wait. And did you know that Save Law is like one of the best cinemas in the whole London? No porkies. You have to take a photograph together outside. Try and stop me. I want to capture every moment we spend together on film. Every single one. Okay, I think that's everyone. Oh, nice. I thought something felt suspicious there. Good, e good evening, Emiliana. Catriel, what are you doing here? Ernest here won tickets to see some lovey dovey film or other, so I decided to come along with him. <laughs> but the question is, what are you doing here, Emiliana? Has there been an incident? No, no, I'm not here to, on police business. I've come to see the film as well. Oh, I didn't realize you were a film buff. Well, I wouldn't describe myself as a buff exactly, but I enjoy the change of pace. Profiling all day demands a huge amount of concentration. Well, the only people here tonight are either involved in the, in the production, VIPs, or they want tickets like I did. So I presume that means you're on the prize draw as well, did you? Ah! Va bene, si, I entered the prize draw, so what? That doesn't make me a film buff. I just entered the, the draw because I feel like it and happened to him. I mean, to be fair, that does tend to happen in lotteries. Ah, that also reminds me. There goes this lottery on the place I used to work. And they had a PS5 as a second prize. I really wanted a PS5. I bought like two or three hundred raffle tickets. I didn't. I sadly didn't win. But you know the, the part that really irks you? The part that really hurt me? My colleagues in the say, Oh look! Your prize ticket is right there sticking on the side where you can, everyone can see it. <laughs> Tiny brincadeira comigo! Why? Uh, that still works with this day. 
But that's incredible. I mean, it's such a long anticipated release. The competition was fierce. Your chances of winning were tiny. I had to enter the draw over 100 times before one. Congratulations. You entered far less than I had to, and I still lost. <laughs> well, I entered more than two. <laughs> I mean, uh, I mean, I'm just a very lucky person, that's all. <sighs> what? I see, I understand. Yes, it's all very clear now. You put up a pretense about not really like films, but the truth is, the truth is, you're here for the dream popcorn. Cat, you're the only one who has a, a black hole for stomach. What? What possible evidence do you have to support such a claim? I... I don't even like popcorn! Wait... Is Cat actually right? You still refuse to admit it? It's not true! Ah... I'm not gonna stand here and argue with you all night, Catriel. I'm going in now. Oh yes, so should we. Or I'll just get our... I'll just get our tickets? Ah yes, hello, sir. You're going to have a good evening, yes? Ah, yes, um, this is rather delicate, sir. Um, you see, yes. I'm afraid the dogs are not permitted to enter the theater. Ha, ah, yes. Eh? Ha, ah, yes. And you see, the ticket is only valid for two persons. Persons usually parting to humans and not canines, yes? Oh, I see. Gosh, Cheryl, I'm so sorry. Never crossed my mind to buy a ticket for you. Oh, Warren, you'd forget your head on if it wasn't screwed on, wouldn't you? And you wouldn't! Well, no, well, there's nothing we can do about it now. I'm afraid we'll just have to wait out here until the film is over, Cheryl. Oh, sure. I'll just hang out in the street like a stray. Disc. I didn't even bring my coat. It's not even as if I can go back and wait to the office. These spots can open the door. No doors. Fine, all right. I'll wait here. Just do me a favor and don't watch all the ending credits. Good boy. We'll be back soon. All right, Ernest, shall we? Ah, oh, yes. <sighs> What doggy deity have I upset to deserve this? <laughs> What's the name of that dog in Japan that kinda... That has a statue for it. Ah! Why? Uh, wait, just a second. Let me, let me check. Just a second, guys. Uh, let's see... Dog statue Japan. Yeah, not Jack Russell. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, ju I just remembered, just remembered. It's Hachiko. Yeah, the statue of the dog uh, is in Japan. Hachiko. I think it's supposed to be a dog deity at this point, right? Ah, this is a rough deal. I'm so bored. Come on, Katniss. How long are you going to leave me out here? At least it didn't time me to a, to a drain pipe. Poor Cheryl. Hello. Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs>